Hopkins in the air to left center field, and the Giants have their first lead of the night. Another double. It's 3-2 San Francisco. I'm Eric Heiss with the MLB.com FastCast, and that was Freddie Sanchez dropping in an RBI double to give the Giants a 3-2 lead in the fifth in Game 1 of the World Series. Cody Ross and Aubrey Huff followed with RBI singles in the frame to chase Cliff Lee after only four and two-thirds of work. But the damage didn't stop there for the Rangers as Juan Uribe put the game away. Hundred left field out of here! Uribe's outing capped a six-run fifth inning for the Giants as their offense came alive in game one of the 106th Fall Classic, fueling San Fran onto an 11-7 win over Texas. They now lead the series one to nothing. You never think you're going to have uh, success, you know, against a pitcher like that. But uh, you know, I just want, we know that he throws a lot of strikes and he gets ahead early. And you know, I think we were able to put the bat on the ball today and find some holes. You know, and I think that's really what it boiled down to. It's one of those games where you know everybody was thinking it was going to be a one to nothing, two to one game, and um, you know nobody thought it was going to be a eleven to seven game. And um, you know, that's just the way this game is. I mean, that's the beauty of it is, you know, that's why we go out there and play. Otherwise, we would just, you know, go by what everybody else thought. Obviously, you got to give credit to their uh, their offense. I mean, they, they had some really good at-bats, and uh, I wasn't really locating as well tonight. And uh, made several mistakes that they capitalized on. The teams are back at it on Thursday with game two of the Fall Classic. The Rangers will fire C.J. Wilson, while the Giants will counter with Matt Cain. For complete postseason coverage, stay locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.